Stop worrying about people stealing your beats. There's a few reasons why. The more your beats are out there in circulation, the better promotion for you. And if people are stealing your beats, that means people want your beats. So it's up to you to market them correctly. The other main reason why is because Beat ID is now available from BeatStars. If you go over to your BeatStars account and you click on the Beat ID, this is a new tab. Click Get Started. It's going to bring you down here. It's your music. Start keeping track of it today with Beat ID. Couple of reasons why Beat ID is awesome. You'll now be able to see where your music lives lives on 25 plus different social platforms you're gonna be able to get paid for placements you didn't even know existed that means if your songs are out there in the world and people ripped your beats off of youtube ripped your beats off of spotify whatever the case beat stars will find them if they're on one of these 25 plus different social platforms they're gonna find it and they're gonna be able to get you paid another reason you'll be able to see who is on your beats so that way you can connect with the artist you can build relationships that way you'll also be able to identify illegal uses of your music and put a stop to them you can pay one time or you can pay monthly two dollars a track you can unlock music historical data today get started what's really cool is that you can go back and add existing beats that you already have had on your beat stars like i have had these beats on there for years now and didn't have any way of tracking them so if somebody ripped them off youtube they just had it and i wasn't really getting paid off of those now i can if i add them to this list right here you can see i already added one of my beats you can go up to the add asset button you can upload a file or you can browse my tracks so you can start a brand new one if you don't have have it uploaded already or you can browse the tracks that you have already within BeatStars. so i'm just going to like go down the list next one up here select it add that one track make sure it's named correctly but choose the date that you released it i think i released this like way back maybe 2019 ish april 1st 2019 you have to add different artwork i'm just going to add a picture of my beautiful face and then once that's uploaded you can hit next step this is where we can just review everything make sure the name is good production date's good the cost is going to be two dollars a month to keep getting it tracked payment method if you have a wallet then you could say renew this payment every month required to continue tracking the asset what happens if i cancel my payment we'll just look at that what does that say if you decide you no longer wish to continue paying for beat id for a track you will still receive tracking benefits for the remainder of the month you've already paid for then once that month expires you will not be charged for the next month of service and you will no longer have tracking and then we can start tracking it's going to go through a processing oh now it's, well that's instant show details wow that's quick. And it's going to take like about 30 days to populate that information. So come back in about, you know, a few weeks to see what it's gotten. It's not going to go instant. It's starting to track now, but it's going to take a little bit to start tracking and see what you have out there in the world. You know, it's, it's searching those 25 different social platforms. So it's going to take some time to populate, but just go through and add every one of your beats that you have in your list. This is something that I wish I had, you know, years ago. I love that they're adding this feature into BeatStars now. It's awesome. It's going to help a lot of producers get paid off of their music where they wouldn't have years ago. And again, I just love when companies try to help the producer community. I love it. There's ways that a company can make money and there's ways that they can help the producer community at the same exact time. This, I think, is one of them. And I stand behind this feature. I love it. It's going to help a lot of producers get paid. This is some really cool information that I wanted to go back in the FA Q section. This is a good one. What's included in a BID report? After scanning the 25 different social platforms, the report will provide you with links to every place it appears on these platforms so you can find out who used your music, when, how many views, likes it's received. The report will also include the match type. There are seven different match types. Exact match, a one of one of your asset, a full match. That means a copy that contains 100% of your asset's content, but also contains additional content. A full match copy is returned that runs five minutes in length. A partial match is 100% of the copy matches your asset, but does not contain the entirety. So that's going to wrap it up. Thank you for watching. I do highly suggest that you try out Beat ID for yourself. I'm going to leave a link down in the description. So please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and make sure to share this with a friend if you get me. Catch me in the next one.